G'day guys, in this video we are going to be looking at absolute advantage and comparative advantage and how we can use specialization and trade in order to maximize production. So first up, absolute advantage is when one individual can perform a task with less resources than another. So we are looking directly at their cost in terms of resources, so it's absolute Let's say we've got a small village populated by two people, Jane and John, and they have two options for getting food, they can cook bread or they can catch fish. Now we'll say Jane takes a couple of hours to cook a loaf of bread, so time is the resource in this case that we are using as the cost for performing the task. However, she can catch a fish in one hour. John, on the other hand, can cook a loaf of bread in one hour, but it takes him two hours to catch a fish. So we can see that John takes less time to cook bread, so he has an absolute advantage at performing that task, and Jane takes less time to catch fish, so she has an absolute advantage in that task. Now let's have a look at how much they can actually produce. First we are going to assume that Jane and John are going to be self-sufficient. So this means that they are just going to produce for themselves and not interact with each other. Jane will be able to cook two loaves of bread in four hours. 